An American Revolution in Talk TV is here. NRA News, Cam and Company on Sportsman Channel. The uh, author Buzz Bissinger, guy who wrote the uh, book Friday Night Lights. Uh, you know, he was one of those who despised uh, or, or who decided to despise uh, gun owners and uh, the NRA after the murders at Sandy Hook Elementary. He was on uh, Piers Morgan. Uh, and he said, I don't care what the justification is that you're allowed in this country to own a semi-automatic weapon, much less a handgun. What do you need a semi-automatic weapon for? Wrote a piece for the uh, Daily Beast. Sorry, don't expect any change after Newtown. He said, uh, the past is prologue. The best indicator of future behavior is past behavior. We cannot let go of the violence. There is an answer, he says. We could ban handguns, as the U.K. did after a mass murder at a school in 97. We could weigh the societal priorities of gun ownership and psychotic killers getting access to semi-automatic rifles with the most potent ammunition available versus not ever allowing an innocent child to die again for the sin of going to school and getting ready for the holidays. But we won't, he says. So again, if we agree with Buzz Bissinger, if we adopt Bloombergian-style gun control, if we acquiesce to President Obama, Buzz Bissinger says never again will we have to witness a tragedy or a horrific murder involving a child. They continue to make this argument. They continue to try to get us to give up control, our responsibilities, and they try to take control away from us, control of our lives. As I said, I've got this theory that one of the reasons why they do this is because they don't have control over their own life. And in the case of Buzz Bissinger, well, it's true. He's got a new uh, article out in GQ where he talks about his shopping addiction. He says that uh, it all began when his wife left for Abu Dhabi and he began to, quote, seek sexual expression in the form of high fashion. Okay. So this 58-year-old man says he spent more than $600,000 on clothes in the past three years, including uh, dozens of pairs of leather pants, which, by the way, if you're a 58-year-old man, if you're a 58-year-old rock star, you may be able to get away with leather pants. If you're a 58-year-old author, not going to happen. Well, Mr. Bissinger, I sure do wish you the best in all of your future endeavors. But while you are dealing with your own issues... Uh, might I suggest you shut up about trying to take away the rights of Americans who actually can be responsible with their money, their lives, and their wardrobes. Oh, and their firearms, too. NRA News, Cam and Company, Monday through Friday at 5 p.m. Eastern on Sportsman Channel.